Welcome to Tomahawk DIY everyone. I'm Mike. Today we're going to take a look at this Dell Latitude. This is a E7440 uh, computer. There's an interesting little thing with these latitudes. You can get an idea, you can know what year it is by the last two digits. The 40 at the end of this lets you know it's a 2014 model year. Today I'm going to show you how to upgrade your memory. So if you need some more RAM, you want to get computer speed moving up, uh, I'll show you how to get in here and replace it. It's not very hard. Alright, on this latitude, E7440, removing the battery, just slide right here, and that lets your whole battery pop out, just like that. Pretty easy. Alright, to get at the hard drive, the memory, other things, you got to remove this cover plate here. All the glue to link, this is a little set that I love from Tekton to Amazon. There's lots of different sets, but it's got some great handy tools for working on small electronics and laptops and things like that. So there's two screws we need to undo here. Now you may want to use your phone, take a picture as you're working on this, taking things apart just so you remember which screws you took out from which places. Slide this toward the front of the system, just like that, and then pull it up. There we go. Lots of tabs all over the place on this bottom cover. Okay, here's our memory slots. If you want to remove memory or upgrade memory, it's really easy. Right here you got these two tabs to pull on. We'll pull on each side. That's how you release the memory. So to install memory, this has two slots for memory. So you can expand it if you don't already have them both filled. Just like that. Super easy. Just make sure you've lined up the correct, line up the correct um, slots. You can't really do it backwards. You come in at a bit of an angle up and then you push it down. Alright, while you're in here there's other things that you can change. Your a wireless card, there's this coin battery that you can replace your fan, upgrade memory. There's a SIM card slot here if you're using a cell phone kind of card. While you're in here look at your fan. It's a great time to clean it out, blow it out with a, a dust cleaner. Check out my other video of actually using a toothpick to clean out uh, the inside of a fan here. You'll be amazed at what kind of dust and buildup can come there. Now remember, look, in, look at your tabs, the way they, the direction they slide before you try to put this thing in, in place. Line up the tabs, it should be sitting nice and flush, and then just give it a little push back. There, you'll know you're ready your screws are lined up. I'm going to loosely put screw one in, I'm going to loosely put screw number two in over here. Tighten that and go back over here, tighten this guy in place. Alright, putting our battery back in now. Remember you put this side in first and then you push down on the pins here. Angle in here, push down, clips in place. There you have it. Upgrade complete. Okay, thanks so much for watching Tomahawk DIY. I hope you found that helpful as we went through this upgrade. You saw it's pretty easy to do. It can be done with just some basic tools. Make sure you've got a quiet place and you don't have static electricity, things like that. I'll leave some, some links where you can pick up different parts. Those are affiliate links. Also, if you found this helpful and feel so inclined, please leave me a tip. You can do that through uh, PayPal or Venmo. I'll include uh, my information so you can find those at the end of the video. Like the video, subscribe, share it, and have a great day.